hello everyone welcome to this video in which we are going to see that how can you fix a google chrome issue where your default search engine is not showing as google anymore so the process for this is pretty simple you might have accidentally changed your search engine to something else and that is a very simple process through which you can change it back to google or in fact in any search engine that you want not necessarily google so how are we going to do that? So first of all, I have opened up my Chrome browser. You can just click on these three dots and go to settings. In the settings on the left panel, you will see something called as search engine. Let's just click on that. And the first option that you will see is a search engine used in the address bar. So that is Google. Make sure that it is Google and nothing else. If it is something else, that means that search engine is your default search engine. That's where it would be used. So we do not want that. We want to keep it to Google. So just click on Google, restart your Google Chrome and the settings would have been applied. So this is how you change your search engine back to Google. But sometimes the issue occurs that your search engine keeps changing back to something else instead of Google, even if you are changing it to Google from here. Then in that case, what you can do is in the same settings, just scroll down and go to extensions. And here you might have accidentally installed some of the malicious extensions. So in case you are seeing some extensions here that you have not installed or you do not know them, then it is better to just turn them off or remove them completely. So in order to turn off or disable an extension, just uh, toggle on this button. This extension is now disabled. If you want to completely remove an extension, just click on remove. It would ask you that do you want to remove this extension? So yes, we want to remove this extension. So just click on remove. Here you want to report an abuse to the Google team. If you want that this is a malicious extension that got installed from I don't know where, you can just file a report for abuse as well. And just click on remove and that particular extension would have been removed. So now this should have solved your issue. And that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.